Hello everyone, welcome to the fastest way to make a million gold. I've decided to start this all over again right here at the beginning because my last method was just simply not going to work like I wanted it to. This time I'm aiming for a million gold right from the beginning, unlike last time, so this way I can set myself up a lot better and not look like a complete mess halfway through the season. I am going to be using some of the glitches and exploits I've learned along the way, especially the ones I've recently learned. I feel like they're not cheating because they're actually part of the game. I don't actually have to alter or change the game in any way myself. I'm just using what the game gives me. So that is completely fair. I know some of you are thinking, wow, this looks really good without the black bars on either side of the screen. And the resolution is so good. Well, I finally figured out the answer to that problem, and it was so simple. All I had to do was buy a monitor for $500. I'm just kidding. I didn't really pay $500 for it. I stole it from some little kid. Don't worry though, he'll never figure out who took it. He was 100% blind. My first order of business on my new strategy is to actually plant and grow something right away. As you may have guessed, by the way, I'm clearing my field. And clearing way too much space but I'm going to need the extra space eventually, so I'm going to start the land clearing earlier than last time. So the game gives you 15 seeds to start with, and I'm going to water those until they're all grown up. And I am going to make a chest right away. I've got the materials for that already. Seeing as I don't have a very big backpack, that's going to help me. And since there's nothing super productive to do on the first day at this point, I'm just going to run around and forage things. Of course, before I get too carried away with that, I'm going to throw some things in the chest. That way I don't overload my poor little backpack. So I've just made my little loop down south in the forest. This is what I got. I'm just going to go ahead and sell it all. I've tried to leave myself lots of time to accomplish this because I'm not sure how long it's going to take and hopefully I can get it done. Otherwise, I'm going to have to restart the day. And because I'm greedy, I'm going to go out of my way to forage those two things. So using my little map trick, I'm going to move myself off the edge of the map on this side. Now that I'm off the edge of the map, I'm going to walk up towards the corner and then over towards where the spa would be. So once I found the entrance to this area, I obviously now have access to the spa, which I wouldn't normally access until the third of summer, I believe. Now, of course, making my way down to the pool area. I'm very simply going to craft a fence post, like so, and I'm going to place it right there. Now for those of you who haven't seen this trick, simply jump into the pool, touch the pole, and swim on out. Now I'm swimming everywhere I go and for everything I do, which means that the game thinks I'm in the spa, therefore I have unlimited energy and unlimited health. So by using a combination of those two glitches, I've gotten myself unlimited energy and whatever from the first day. So that means I'm going to be able to make a lot of money really fast. The other benefit is I can work right up until I pass out because the next day my energy just regenerates itself anyway. I did however play with this. I can't leave the spa yet otherwise I just get stuck in a stone wall as far as I could tell so I just have to sit here until I pass out and then I can start my productive day two. I was also hoping there'd be something cool to see up here on day one because you can't normally gain access to it but there doesn't seem to be anything different. I could try going to that area north of here to see if there's anything crazy going on up there but I'm too lazy right now. Maybe someone else could check that out for me and uh, throw that in the comments down below. Thank you. I'm probably going to break this series up into a few days at a time. That way I have a little bit of time to think about my next step and be sure to do it pretty efficiently. Although I never quite get it right, I can always think of ways I could have been doing it better. I'm getting better every time. This time should be a short journey to a million. Here's the numbers for day one. 396 gold. Nothing special. Obviously the priority there was getting my unlimited energy. So here I am. Day two, clearly not land sharking. The glitch obviously doesn't work if you pass out at 2 a.m. I thought it would, 
that really sucks. I was gonna do a whole kind of series on videos that stemmed from this idea. Unfortunately it didn't work so that is really disappointing. So you guys get this disappointing failure of a video. Perhaps one of you would be so kind as to point out a fun new idea for another video or a series of videos because I was banking on making quite a few videos off this idea. This just goes to show not all ideas work out the way I want them to. Hope you all enjoyed this dead end video. Thanks for watching.